friends welcome back to my channel my name is Lisa if y'all don't know okay so today I have a new product here that I found online it's called um, Sun Touch hair lightener so I thought this was so cool because um, you know well during quarantine it was hard to go get your hair done and all this stuff right but now it's okay but I kind of wanted to find like a different solution if say for example I can't get my hair done or I just want like kind of more of like a natural product to put in so I found this one it's a bottle like this here and it looks like this super sunny today so I thought today would be a really good day to do this so the sun touch was born out of inspiration from the sea and sun. Our products were designed for internal sun seeker and those who wish they could spend other time on the ocean and in the sunshine. Our hair lightener amplifies the lightning effect of sun, resulting in gorgeous sun-kissed hair all year round. Our formula is heated active and can therefore be used despite having access to sunny beach or not. Okay, so it looks, it's very cute packaging. And it looks like this little bottle here. That. So I'm really excited to try this because I'm not sure if it's going to work or not. So I was going to do like one side of my head and then wait. But I don't want my hair to be uneven. So I'm just going to do the whole thing. I already took a picture. So I'm going to see if it's... Let's go to the instruction. It says... On dry or wet hair, spray generously enough to dampen your hair. Limit contact on the skin, so comb throughout to spread sun touch evenly. Okay, so I guess I shouldn't wear this because um, I don't want it touching my skin. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm just gonna wear a sweater over so it doesn't touch my skin here. Um, it's really sunny right now, so I think this is gonna be a little bit hard to show like my before and after, but we'll see. It's probably gonna brighten up a lot more. Um, okay, let's go. Um, after that, expose your hair directly to the sun or use a blow dryer to, on low heat for four to three to four minutes. Results will be visible in two to three hours with either method and will be visible the following day okay so i'm gonna see if the sun still stays out in two or three hours if it doesn't then i am going to um show you my results tomorrow and take a picture then um and then yeah so if you want to make your hair lighter you just keep repeating the process until you reach the level of lightness that you want and um no more than once between shampoo Enjoy your beautiful sun touch hair. Lighten results are permanent. So that's a little bit scary. But I think it's going to be good. Okay, so let's go. Let's stamp this. Let's use this. Um, oh, I'm so nervous. Okay, hold on. Oh my god, it smells so good. It's, it smells like coconut, I think. Okay, so that's kind of getting a little bit damp. A little bit more. So I'm only going to do it two times because, you know, it's better to not overdo it. Maybe I should have counted the number of pumps that I'm doing, but it's okay. I'm not sure if I sprayed it. <gasps> no, okay, anyways. Okay, cover. Cover your eyes, guys. Okay. 
sorry. So it's looking pretty damp here, like that. Comb through to spread it out evenly. And then I guess we will see. So the one I got, this one is for dark hair, and then they also have one for light hair. All right, so I will probably be back in two, maybe three hours. I'm thinking two hours, but the sun might set by then. So I don't know if the video is going to be a different color, but we'll see. If not, then I'll try to do it in the morning tomorrow when it's sunny. I feel like it's not damp enough. Okay, I'm going to do it one more time. This time I'm going to... sun that long so I'm gonna go and blow dry it and see okay okay I don't know if this lighting is good or not but this is after I blow dried it and I don't know I can't really tell the difference but maybe if I take a picture then I'll see Sure. <laughs> yes, this is how I take selfies. Okay, but like honestly, natural lighting is always, it's a little bit harsh sometimes, but um, smooshy, pretty good. Okay, so I'm gonna just kind of go through my pictures here. Oh my god. Okay. I'm gonna try to pop it in and show you guys like these pictures, but I think there's a difference. What the hell? Oh my god, I'm so excited to see how it's gonna turn out tomorrow because I don't know. I am so excited to maybe try this one more time. If this video is too harsh, um, I'm gonna try to film on the second time I'll do it, I'll do it on my new iPhone, which is coming in the mail. It should be today. I keep missing it. I don't know why I'm like home. Like UPS, you need to do a better job. Like ring the doorbell, leave a notice or something. Like they don't even have any notice like that they put on. But anyway, okay. Um, yeah, so this is my hair now, guys. What do you guys think? Do you guys like it? Do you guys even see a difference? Because I, I think it's lighter and it's only been, oh my gosh, I didn't even check the time. So I believe that was 20 minutes or so. So yeah, I'm really excited. It looks really good. Hi darlings. Okay, so this is the next day. I don't know if the sun is too harsh, but honestly, I feel like it's a lot lighter. What do you guys think? Yeah. Oh, the sun is really, really bright today, so, um, yeah, I don't know. Should I do it one more time? Maybe I should wait? I don't know. Okay, maybe I should use it one more time and see how light it goes. So I don't know if I should be using this camera. I guess I should just stick to it because I've been using it already, so we'll see. Because I kind of want to use my new phone. I got my phone back, guys. Okay, we'll see anyways, whatever.
kind of hard to spray. I think I would only do this maybe like three times. I don't know. I don't think. Let's see if it will get the top of my head more. Lighter. Okay, that is pretty damp, I believe. And I will probably take a video for you guys next time. Look at, okay, that's light. It's so hard with lighting because you never know exactly. Okay, so we'll see. Like lately it's been like, I've been feeling like I have better hair now. I don't know why, but. <laughs> We'll see, okay? Okay, so this is my hair a week and a half later. I definitely think it got a little bit lighter. It's hard to tell because sometimes the lighting is so different. Like sometimes it's so bright and then sometimes it's not. So yeah, this is how it looks like now. I'm not really having a good hair day today, so maybe i can show you guys when i actually shower and have a really good hair day to see if the color kind of got a lot brighter than the other one this is my hair um after using the sun touch for about wait i used it in february so almost two weeks now so um i really want to try to do this review give you guys like my honest thoughts about it and how I really like it or not and right now I'm just really not sure and that's just my honest truth and I'm not having a good hair day today I just want to like put it up so um yeah until next time hi darlings okay so this is an update on what I think about the what is it called again <laughs> the um, Sun Touch, the Sun Touch Hair Lightener Spray. And this is my hair today. To be honest, there is no difference. Like I think the first time I just, like it was so sunny out. And I think when you have blonde hair, you kind of just automatically go, oh my God, it's brighter, you know? But it's kind of like, you know, when you just freshly wash your hair, I feel maybe, that spray had some minerals and vitamins or something that when you spray it onto your hair it just maybe feels or looks nicer in a way every time you wash your hair you're gonna be like oh my hair is so fresh and clean clean so that's what i think happened and yeah so this is my hair now it's not lighter and how i can kind of tell if the product worked is if someone comments on my hair saying that oh my goodness your hair like did you do your hair again did you lighten it nobody zero zilch nobody said anything like that so that's kind of a good indicator when you can kind of tell if people notice oh my god my hair over here is so frizzy <laughs> other than that like i feel like i got a lot of split ends i don't know if it's because of the product but um or i just need to get a haircut or whatnot but that is my final touch with <laughs> that is my final thought about sun touch don't get it you know i'm one of those people who kind of get like very naive about like <laughs> when i see a product online i'm like oh my god that's so cool um but yeah don't believe the internet sometimes they can do such a good job of photoshopping the pictures so if you know, cause I, trust me, I did my, re I'm like, okay, let me go see all the results and see if like the girls are getting good results. And like, you can't tell because sometimes when they do Photoshop on 
your hair or not, they can make it look so real that you will think it's real. So just be careful out there. Sometimes you just want to believe in a product and you just want to believe in uh, something you buy, but like, <laughs> yeah, just do your research. Um, even though like they, they know, they know that you're going to look at reviews and this and that, but if you can get someone real honest opinion about a product or whatnot, then take it. So that's my you know i was really bummed out because i really wish it lightened my hair and you know, i just wanted kind of like a natural lightened look but anyways um i will stick to my hairdresser uh she does an amazing job and i hope i didn't damage my hair or anything like that but you know judging from the product the ingredients were pretty natural i actually really did like spraying my hair with that you know and then blow drying it after i don't know afterwards my hair just felt like nice <laughs> it is just like clean yeah so that's my final thoughts thanks for watching ladies if you like this type of videos or have anything you want me to kind of review or try out put it down in the comments below and i can do that for you uh sorry i've been kind of really busy with work i haven't been able to post a video in a while but Trust me, I'm trying to get some stuff out there with, for you guys, but um, just trying to deal with time management and it's a little bit hard, but I'm going to get there and I hope you guys enjoy. All right. Bye, darlings. See you next time. Bye.